Hello everyone, Edward here and welcome to Windows Report. And in this video I will show you how to easily remove your PIN on Windows 11. So basically you're kind of tired of having to authenticate every time you power on your PC and since no one else is using it you decide to remove the PIN. So you press the Windows button then go and select the settings icon and in the settings window on the left pane you choose account. Then on the right side of course you select sign in options and then you head straight to the PIN category. And this is where it gets really frustrating. You simply can't remove your PIN. It's grayed out and it's quite annoying. But here's the trick. This happens because you're signed in with a Microsoft account instead of a local account. So if you want to remove any authentication method, simply do this. Go back to accounts, then select your info from the right pane. Then in the next slide under account settings, you have an option highlighted in blue that says sign in with a local account instead and simply click it. You will then be asked if you really want to switch to a local account and you will be required to verify your current identity in order to be allowed to make that switch. In here, simply input your current Microsoft account password and press OK. Afterwards, you will have to edit your local account info. So basically, this is like a new account, but it's not strictly tied up to the Microsoft account. Now you can decide on the username and please note that if you want to have no authentication requirement when you power on your PC or boot Windows, simply leave the password boxes empty. Just don't write anything. Then simply click on next. You will then be signed out of your Microsoft account and then signed back into the new local account. And that's it. Now if you go back to the account sign-in options, you will see that you need to set up a new password to even have access to setting up a PIN. But always make sure you're the only one using this PC as having no authentication method will leave your PC vulnerable to other users. So that was it. Pretty easy, isn't it? As usual, for more information and details, you can check the article in the description below. And if you enjoyed this video, just make sure to like and subscribe to our channel. Thank you.